Four people have died during an attempt to cross the English Channel. The French Coast Guard say a boat capsized during the crossing, crossing from France to the UK. 63 migrants were rescued overnight. The incident happened off the coast of Boulogne-sur-Mer in northern France. Large numbers of people have continued to cross the Channel this year, despite poor weather conditions making the journey more dangerous. Well, the Home Secretary, Yvette Cooper, has posted on X in the last hour, saying the further loss of life in the Channel this morning is truly awful. My thoughts are with all those affected. Criminal gangs are making vast profits from putting lives at risk. We are accelerating action with international partners to pursue and bring down dangerous smuggler gangs. Well, the former Home Secretary, James Cleverley, has also commented on the incident. He said on X, reports of more deaths in the Channel are a tragedy. As a country, we must do everything in our power to stop the boats and put an end to this vile trade in human suffering. Our Europe correspondent, Adam Parsons, has the latest. What I can tell you is this boat was setting off from Boulogne, so actually much further round the coast from, from Calais and Dunkirk, from where we've seen... Uh, most of these uh, these migrant crossings happening, they have actually gone from even further than that in recent times. This was in the early hours uh, of this morning, uh, and it was spotted at 4.30, the boat was spotted by uh, by one of the French vessels that patrols that area called Mink. It hired, uh, called in a helicopter support. Other boats went to the scene. Uh, and what they discovered was uh, a mi an inflatable boat carrying migrants that had deflated uh, on its way across the channel. Uh, and uh, that they spotted that there were people in the water. They rescued uh, some of those 14 picked up from a, by a fishing vessel uh, and, uh, and 49 others by this boat, the Mink, which is one of the, these fixed, very large, I've seen it myself, uh, wrestle, uh, rescue vessels that patrols in the channel. But as well as those that were pulled out of the water, there were three who were pulled out, what they called inanimate, so that's, that's uh, unconscious from the water, another uh, unconscious person who's on the wreckage uh, of the vessel, and those four unconscious people were given uh, were given attempts to to save them, but uh, all died. Could not be resuscitated, according to the French authorities. The shipwreck people were then taken to Boulogne and handed over into the care of the emergency services. So four dead, sixty three rescued. Uh, th this uh, weather was not particularly good uh, for this crossing. And this, the first, uh, I suppose, huge incident to happen since the change uh, of government. The previous government put such focus on, uh, as we know, stopping the small boats. Uh, it, it has been a change of tack. We know the Labour government came in, immediately cancelled the Rwanda plan, have brought in their new form. Uh, of, uh, of, of border command, border security command has been launched by them. But this, of course, will put uh, more focus once again on this incredibly thorny, uh, difficult to resolve question of how you can slow or even prevent these crossings of, of flimsy inflatable boats overpacked with people trying to get from France into the UK.